Urban Africa is bursting with opportunity. As our cities continue to grow, this is our moment to embrace sustainability and build resilience without the carbon emissions often associated with rapid development. Many cities and regions are already leading the way. Residents of Kasese in Uganda run their homes with affordable solar home systems that they can buy on credit and repay over time at fair rates. In Nilongwe, Malawi, community members use organic waste that would have polluted their river systems to make compost. More than anywhere, there is an urgency in Africa for upscaling these projects. Now, temperatures on the continent will rise higher than the global average, and it will be one of the hardest hit by climate change, even though we contribute only 3% to causing it. In a world where climate adaptive efforts are weak, Africa could lose 6% of its GDP in residual losses because of it. But our people are resilient and our leaders have a unique opportunity to create climate-ready and crisis-resistant cities. The Covenant of Mayors in Sub-Saharan Africa supports signatory cities to reach their climate and energy goals by providing practical support, technical assistance and access to partnerships. COMSA is the regional chapter of the Global Covenant of Mayors for Climate and Energy, making signatory cities part of the largest network of cities taking climate action in the world. COMSA is pushing the boundaries of climate action and providing virtual platforms for leaders to connect, overcoming prevailing connectivity and accessibility issues to empower signatories to become healthy, green, climate-resilient cities. To date, we support cities from over 35 countries. We've told over 100 stories, hosted more than 65 engagements, and created hundreds of connections to tech cities from climate planning to on-the-ground action. It all starts with a plan. Cities create sustainable energy access and climate action plans to determine their baselines and get a snapshot of how their city will look should it follow its current development track. Two-stroke bicycles might work well in Garua, Cameroon right now, but they are notoriously emission-heavy and fewer inefficient. If every adult in 2050 drove one, the city would suffocate and fewer would run out. Cutting down trees for charcoal isn't making a dent in the canopy and forests of Bobo Diulasso in Burkina Faso right now. But if every family felled a tree a week up to 2050, the garden city would soon be a desert. Low carbon infrastructure projects can change these trajectories sidestepping future emissions while providing citizens with access to key services like energy, water, mobility, and sanitation. This requires funding, but only 3% of global climate finance currently flows to Africa. We share best practices from the region, develop resources and endeavor to help cities secure funding in innovative ways and turn their climate plans into their realities. In Benin, the national government and UNCDF found a way to channel finance from the Green Climate Fund to the commune of Copargo, with which they constructed a water retention basin and a water levy. Farmers now have more water at their disposal to diversify their crops and boost the local economy. We need hundreds more inspiring projects like these. But not all cities have the skills, capacity or regulations in place yet to make it work. This is why COMSA and GCOM partnerships are crucial. Cities have access to technical experts, researchers, financiers and civil society organizations to support them. They can also share their learnings with each other at online and in-person events created specifically for this purpose. Once African cities commit to take climate action, COMSA meets them where they are on their sustainability journey. Whether it's planning for climate action, access climate finance, implementing on-the-ground infrastructure projects, forming valuable partnerships or sharing knowledge and experiences with other cities, together we can spearhead truly African solutions, becoming an unstoppable community of practice for climate action and sustainable energy.
In the next few years, COMSA aims to mobilize 160 million euros for climate and energy projects and enable the development of climate plans and actions across the continent that lead to 220,000 tons less greenhouse gas emissions than business as usual. This is equivalent to removing 5,000 fossil fueled cars off the road or planting 3,500 hectares of trees. Ultimately, this work will empower countless more cities to do it for themselves. This community of practice is rippling across the continent. The future is definitely urban and often uncertain. The future city is undoubtedly resilient and African. Throughout its journey, COMSA has received generous technical and political support from a range of stakeholders. COMSA is co-funded by the European Union, the German Ministry for Economic Development and Cooperation, and the Spanish Agency for International Development Cooperation.